men from Orlando are locked up after a police pursuit across three Bay Area counties. It ended with their car crashing into a Florida Highway Patrol cruiser near Lakeland. Before that chase began, though, police say that the two men robbed a woman at gunpoint in Tarpon Springs. That was also caught on camera. Eight on your side's Justin Shecker joins us live by an I-4 on-ramp with new information about these suspects. Justin. Well, Rod and Jen, good evening to you. That high-speed pursuit went more than 60 miles for ending with the crash on I-4 in Polk County. Tonight, we've learned the suspects had a stolen gun, and one of them is accused of trying to get rid of the evidence. Terrifying moments caught on camera in Tarpon Springs as two men robbed a woman at gunpoint. They followed her home early Sunday morning, more than 25 miles from the club where she works on Dale Mabry Highway in Tampa. Tarpon Springs police say they have arrest warrants for 20-year-old Trayvon Sullivan and 19-year-old Ralph Peoples in connection to the armed robbery. But today, both men from Orlando faced a judge in Polk County where the pursuit ended with their car slamming into a highway patrol cruiser on I-4. The two local charges are grand theft of a firearm and the second charge is tampering with physical evidence. Court documents obtained by 8 on your side say FHP dash cam video caught Peoples throwing a gun and a multicolored bag out the passenger front door. Turns out the firearm had been reported stolen out of Orange County. Vehicles traveling 130 miles per hour. Sullivan has been identified as the driver, so he's facing the stolen gun charge and the felony of fleeing or attempting to elude. And Tarpon Springs police say the two suspects will be transported back to Pinellas County. The fiance of the victim tells eight on your side, women who work late nights in bars and clubs, especially this time of year, need to be extra vigilant on their way home. Live in Tampa, I'm Justin Shecker, eight on your side.